Hello guys, today I will show how you can configure Dokkan Strap Connect on your multi vendor platform. Before starting, I need to describe that what is Stripe Connect and how it will work with Dokkan. Stripe Connect will allow you to split the payment between your admin account and your vendor account after purchasing a product by your customer. Let's say if your customer is purchasing from 5 vendors, if your admin commission is 10%. And then after completing the purchase, the admin will get the 10% uh, commission to his own uh, Stripe account and the rest of the vendors will get their own money to their own Stripe accounts. To, to get the money into the vendor Stripe account, each and every vendor needs uh, need their own Stripe Connect uh, account. They need to connect their account from the vendor dashboard. So let's see how the admin will configure his uh, own Stripe account for the marketplace. At first from the module section you need to enable the Dokkan Stripe Connect module. If you are using any other Stripe um, plugin then I suggest you to disable that before activating Dokkan Stripe Connect. Be to enable the Dokkan Stripe Connect module which I have already enabled here. So after enabling that, you need to visit the WooCommerce settings menu. And from the settings panel, you can see there is a payment step. So let's uh, enter to the payment step. On this tab, you will get an option called uh, Dokkan Strap Connect. Uh, you need to enable the gateway from here by toggling the button. Now I have enabled it and now I need to configure it first. So if I click on the Stripe Connect section, it will open a new settings panel for Stripe. Saying that and then if you need to uh, change the title for the gateway which you will show on the checkout page. So by default it's saying uh, Dokkan credit card. So if you want that your customer should not see Dokkan, so you can just uh, rewrite to card payment. and if you are from Europe and if your country requires uh, secure authentication then you need to enable 3D security but if you are not uh, from that country which requires uh, secure authentication then you can disable it uh, and also uh, in Dokkan Stripe Connect if vendor is not connected uh, on their Stripe account then none of the customer would be able to purchase that vendor product so if if the admin want that uh, i will still allow the customer to purchase from a non-connected vendor then you need to enable this option from here uh, if it's enabled that means if any vendor is not connected to a stripe account still the customer would be able to purchase from that particular vendor and the inter amount will be received by the admin uh, to his own stripe account and later the vendor will make a withdraw request to get the money okay uh, uh, as i am configuring this on my local server uh, so i will enable test mode and i will leave this as it is now as it is not live so i will just configure the uh, test credential here now the main question is how you will get this credential. To get that you need to log into a Stripe account first. Now I am logged in so what I need to do uh, from I need to at first I need to enable test mode because I am just testing the Stripe platform. So if you are using test mode then you must need to enable this option from here and now I need to click on the settings then what I will see there is an option called connect sometimes you might not uh, see the connect option here if you are not seeing the connect option that means your account is not uh, applicable for the connect platform in that case you need to apply for it from the strap.com there is an option to apply for the connect account and if you have it already then uh, that's a, a great thing you can just easily connect uh, your account so first of all i need to click on the developers uh, menu and from here i can see there is a menu called api keys 
so i will uh, click on the api key and here you can see that i have the publish key so i will click on it and i will copy it then i will get back to the website and i will paste it here this is the place for publish key and now i need the secret key so here from here i will generate a secret key and it's uh, i have copied it from here now i will paste into the secret key field now i need the client id uh, that's the most complicated thing uh, many users are uh, failing there that they don't get the client id correctly what you need to do you need to click on the settings again and from the connect option you need to click on the settings button and from the connects uh, area then you need to enable uh, this standard account authentication here also here you can see the client id you need to copy the client id and then paste it to the client id field now uh, click on the save changes now settings uh, has been done now if you want uh, your vendor to connect to your marketplace from their vendor dashboard you have to insert the redirect url copy the redirect url which you are getting there and get back to the stripe platform and then add a uh, I, I i need to remove the uh, existing one first and now you need to add a redirect url from here and now paste the url you are done so i think the uh, admin configuration has been done if you are on live mode then you have to do the same thing just you need to change the uh, you need to turn off the test data from here and then you need to generate the new api keys for the live platform now uh, i'm done with the admin configuration now my vendor would be uh, ready to go and they can easily now connect their own stripe account now let's switch to a vendor Now uh, I can switch to this one. Now go to the vendor dashboard settings and from the payment tab the vendor would be able to connect his own Stripe account where you can see the button. If I click on it then it will redirect me to the Stripe page. Okay. So it is it is saying that do you want to connect your account? So one thing needs to be noted here that the vendor account should be a separate stripe account from the admin account the admin account cannot be a vendor account that means the same account cannot be used by the admin and the vendor so the vendor stripe account needs to be unique so from there uh, you can just connect your stripe account the vendor will connect and they will start uh, selling that's all thank you very much